Hey guys, Dancing Horse A56 here, and I'm gonna give you a tour of my Briar Barn Sunset Ridge Staples. So right here is the sign, and obviously it says Sunset Ridge Staples. We do boarding, training, lessons in English and Western, breeding, showing, selling, and camp. So this is what you see when you get here. Down here is Maple and she's our greeting and guard dog and right here is Jane she is one of the owner's daughters moving over here is another one of the owner's daughters their oldest Michelle and she's getting some grain to go catch her horse in the pasture this is the grazing pasture and this is how you get in the little gate here yeah. Um, <clears throat> so, you enter and you see this lovely grass. So, over here we have a school mare named Pepper. And over here is Phoenix. He belongs to Michelle. That's why she was over there. She's coming in to catch him. So, right there is some wa uh, a water trough. Over here is Nutmeg, and he belongs to the vet and her daughter. They share him. Over there, um, on the left is Spirit, and on the right is Naomi. And they're pretty much wild, and they roam the 150 acres we have here. Um, over here, this is Amy, and she is the vet's daughter and assistant and she's in the foal barn right now where there's only one foal that's ray of sunshine or sunny and um amy likes to take care of her and she's hoping that we'll get some more foals here so she'll have more foals to play with and take care of in here is extra hay storage and it's also just a shelter for the horses that live in the pasture so when there's bad weather they can come in here and that cat is Patches um, he can get a little feisty so he's not good with strangers um, this is Annie and she's the dog that guards the full barn most of the dogs have their own little section that they guard so that's her area and that's basically the grazing pasture. Um, over here we have the tack up area. Um, and it's basically just this teeny little paddock that you can put your horse in or you can tie your horse to the fence by these. And yeah. And it can also be used as an extra pasture. Um, so it can fit about one horse or like two ponies. Um, and there's some grain for in case the horse is in here as a pasture. Over here we have our mounting block. And these are just some tack boxes that hold some random stuff. Like in here we have polo wraps and bell boots and sponges, and tack cleaning supplies, and whatever. And this one has all the grooming supplies. So like sponges, fly spray, uh, curry combs, brushes, sweat scraper, coat shine, hoof polish, all that jazz. So yeah, that is that part. Over here, well that's Shadow the cat. And he's named Shadow kind of because of his color, but mostly because he just follows people around and he's like their shadow. So, on with the horses that are in the main barn. This is the main barn. Uh, so, in here is like one of my favorite horses of all time ever, Idicus. He is so pretty. I love him. Hence the blanket that's to keep from scratching. <clears throat> so yeah that's his stall and all four of these stalls see there's one two and three four and all four of them 
open up into a pasture so you can just open the door and your horse will or the horse will be allowed out so and each horse most of the horses have a nameplate you can't see them that great right here but you can see them better on the other side but they have a nameplate and then a halter hook not all of them have that but most and this is Pam she's the vet she's going in to check on Jasper now Jasper is a fairly young horse he is only about three and he's very green and he belongs to Kate the trainer and coach so she is like um trying to train him and yeah basically just break him in and so he's getting a checkup he's about to enter his very first show so that's what his checkup is all about so that's this these two horses um over here on the side we just have some bags random like shoulder bags right there is a feed bag lunge line um that is the diagram of our cross country course and that is a diagram of a jump course at an upcoming show that many of our riders are entering so that's for practice up here is a vet first aid kit bale of hay this is our newest little kitten Sophie she's very mischievous um, those are some extra blankets see that one says honey it's embroidered for honey and you'll meet her later um, those are just that's just a cabinet back there's some extra coats and show clothes and whatnot um, but as you can see this cabinet says ridge and this one says sunset so if you go from a distance it's sunset ridge oh and there's lights up here just if it's dark and I feel like turning them on um, back there is a sleeping bag and behind that is a cat carrier um, and these are two more cats Haley and Cloud and on this side we have obviously the ladder and then we have the parts of the horse uh, some apples and some other snacks so that's the big the main part of the main barn <laughs> Oh, and you can see there's a hay net in here. They can share that. And then there's, like, feed things right there. So, yeah. Moving around to the other side. We move into this pasture. So, right as you walk in, you see the, tr like, trough with hay and a water bucket. Oh, and by the way, this is how you get in. It's a gate. Um, so this is like an extra arena slash paddock. It can sometimes be a paddock, but it's not for grazing because there's no grass. It's just like gravel stuff. So, yeah, they don't like to, we don't like to use it as a paddock very much. Because the stones can get stuck in the horse's hooves and that's not good. But like I said, all these doors open so that the horses can just be free. So if they really want to, they can come out here. But as you can see, it's really being used as an arena right now. Uh, so, yeah. This is Red Hot Tamale slash Secretariat slash Red. Yeah, he has a lot of names. And there's his halter. And they, most of them have halters. Um, soon we'll be upgrading and making better halters. So, I hope that we can get those soon. Um, so, yeah, this is Haley, and she's writing Wishful Thinking, or Wish. And she's learning how to jump right now. She's balancing, and she's going to go over this cavaletti type jump thing. And, this, and she's also the owner's youngest daughter. And right here is Megan and she's Jane's twin um, so yeah the owners have four daughters they have an oldest daughter twins and then the younger this is Haley so yeah um, in here is Seattle Sloop so you can see the nameplates a little better Seattle Sloop and he's in here 
And I love him. He's so beautifully detailed and pretty. Love him. Basically, these are like pretty much all my favorite horses. So, but they're all um all three of these are barn owned and then Jasper is obviously owned by Kate. I said that. Okay. <clears throat> so that's it for the main barn. Over here we have Rainbow Sprinkles, or just Sprinkles, and she's a lesson horse. And this is Trix, who would be a lesson horse, but has a broken leg, so she's not. Um, currently, she's just resting. In here we have the tack room. That's how you get in. There's a mat right there. Oh, and this is Max, the tack room guard dog. Um, that is Sam Dalmatian. He hangs out in here. Over here we have saddle pads and jumper pads. Over there is, um, stall cleaning supplies. Um, saddle racks with saddles. That bucket has fairy supplies and a martingale. That is a chair just if you want to sit there to clean your tack or whatever. Um, that's Sarah the trainer's daughter. Behind her are some cross-country vests and farrier chaps, blankets. There's a lunge whip back there. There's some crops down there. Um, helmets, top hat, cowboy hats. Oh, up there are chaps, ha uh, full chaps and half chaps. And over there are some bags of just, like, generic feed or whatever. We have specialized feed in the feed room, but these are, like, this is, like, a new shipment. Right there, that's Stephanie. She's a stable hand. And she's at the hose right now. And this right here is Lily. She's a rider. She takes lessons. Um, and down there, that's Sunday. And he is another tack room dog. And over here we have the Western Bridles. This is mainly an English barn, so there's like one hook for the Western Bridles. Um, two Western Saddles. Another Western Saddle. Lots of English Saddles. Um, that peg's empty because that's the one that Haley's using on Wish. Up here we have the Schedule. Some lead ropes and a bunch of bridles. So yeah, that's pretty much it for the tack room. This like pasture thing. Sorry, she's laying down. <laughs> she fell. And the entrance and the paddock. So look for part two where I'll do the arena. The school horse barn, the minis, and the borders. So thanks for watching. Bye!